Hi, this is Tech Nerd. In this video, I'm going to show you how to drive traffic to your website and increase engagement on your website by having a forum. Uh, log into the admin page of your website and go to your dashboard. You want to look for a plugin called BB Press. Go to plugin and click on admin. Okay, there you have it. I didn't even have to search for it. Because I already have it installed, the installed button is not highlighted. So I'm going to go to installed plugins and just look for it. Click on activate. And I have it right here. Forums. So I'm going to go ahead and create the sections for the forum, the sections that I want on my forum. Click on new forum. Okay, uh, let's say I want a section called Windows Solution. All I have to do is type in the name of the section and just click on publish. Okay, so what you want to do now is to make the forum appear as a page on your website. Go to pages and click on add new. Create a page called forum. And on the text box, type in, in parentheses. EBP. Make sure this is on text, not visual when you're typing this. Make sure it's on text. Type BBP iPhone form and iPhone again index and close the parentheses and click on publish. So we have the forum as a page. Now I'm going to go ahead and add the forum to the menu on the website. Go to appearance, click on menu, and um, on pages, you want to choose forum, add to menu. Now we have it on the menu, save menu. Now let's see what it looks like on the website. There we have it, forum. So um, you can just click on the website and uh, write a topic, whatever you want. And it's as simple as that. Now to go further, if you want people to be able to register on your website before they can come in on your forum, you want to go ahead to dashboard and create a login panel on your website. To do that, you'd go to widget on the appearance and drag the BBPress login widget, widget to wherever you want it on your website. Some You might want it on the header part of your website as a widget or, the, or, or as a footer, but I prefer to have it on the sidebar, so I'm going to just bring it in. I have it already. So, just click on save. Okay, now you have a register panel and a lost password panel. But then you have to put a link for people to register. So, what you want to do is create a register page and a lost password recovery page. Go to pages, click on add new, create a page, a registration page, and ensure this is on the text, like I said before. In parentheses, type BBP 
hyphen register close parenthesis and click on publish then go ahead and copy the link to the page copy the link to the page then go back to the widget on the, on the appearance sidebar widget oh i have two right now so i'm gonna just delete one i only need one login panel so uh i'm gonna go right ahead and paste it here the register i did this already but i'm just gonna delete it so i can put it through on how to do it so i'll just um type in on on the register panel i'm going to paste what i copied from the page and save then i want to create a lost password um link so that people can recover their password if they lose it so i'll go back to page again and add a new page called password recovery page In parentheses, you want to type um, pvp iPhone lost iPhone again pass and then close publish. Once published, copy the link address. Right here copy link address and go back to appearance widgets uh, the pp press login widget uh, paste that link I copied right here and click on save now let's see what we have on the website okay so now i'm logged in but if i log out i'm going to see the login panel so a user on my website can actually type the username and password once they registered if you want to register just click on register and if they want they've lost their password they want to recover all they have to do is click on lost password and then put your email and click on reset password and they're going to get your password in your email. If I go to forum, if I'm logged in, I can create a topic. I can contribute on each section. If I want to create a uh, a topic under, um, uh, let's say Windows solutions, all I have to do is to log in, and then I'll be able to create a topic. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click on subscription on our website so you can watch more videos i'm going to be adding more videos on how to make your forum more interesting allow people to post media videos and pictures uh thank you once again this is tech nerd i hope to see you soon on another video thank you